good morning everyone and welcome to another vlog so today i have a very exciting day ahead i am going to a new medi spa in central london it's just off oxford street it's called callan parlor and it's on great titchfield street i think um literally around the corner from also house which i think is so easy and convenient for me let me see if i can put you down somewhere because i feel like we need to chat okay so that is a bit better so yeah what do i need to catch you guys up on so um i've been kind of invited down to this spa for a like nice little galentine's treat valentine's treat um I've, i think by the time this actually comes up the offer for like a couples or with your mum or anything like that or a friend partner they do a deal for two it's like a self-love package i don't think that will still be on there but i'll double check on their website and i will leave it linked down below um they probably will have something for like mothers day or something like that um coming up in the future just because i think if you don't really live in london it is like you know it gives you enough time to come down and experience you know the spa if, if they do have anything else coming up in the future um what else was i going to say so yeah it's a really great location if you are shopping in selfridges or on bond street it is super close so definitely check that out so i'll be going down there today and then i actually have a really exciting weekend i'm going to penny hill park it was a christmas present from my boyfriend and we are going down there just to relax just to escape the city and penny hill park is not like really far away so it's actually really great i think it's like 45 minutes in the car and that's with like london traffic so i'm so excited to go i've never been there before so it should be a lot of fun and i just thought why not vlog it um and then next week is actually my birthday i can't believe it i'm gonna be another year older Ugh, my life has changed so much so i'm excited for what will you know what's to come I'm also editing a video so my appointment isn't until 11 so i've still got time to kind of like get my stuff together my hair is looking a bit crazy i think i might just put it in like a bun or something and it's actually a really cold day as well so i'm really looking forward to going to this space getting a little bit pampered ahead of like my spa weekend um i'm going in for a facial and a pedicure so obviously like i'm going to be going around in the saunas and stuff my feet's going to be on show so this pedicure is well needed and my skin is currently going through a bit of a bad patch and i'm going to be getting a hydrofacial never got a hydrofacial before so that will be really exciting um it's meant to like really suck out all the gunk in your skin and i just think after christmas and all the indulgence and the alcohol i think it's just what my skin needs just to suck all the ickiness out and just put in all the hydration so that is the plan um i'm going to quickly finish off this video i'm gonna edit um and i'll catch up with you guys all at the callan parlor and show you guys around and yeah it should be fun it should be a lot of fun exciting vlog this week so obviously we're coming up to valentine's day and galentine's day so i'm here at the new medi spa on great titchfield street it's called callan parlor and it is so chic i think that's how you pronounce it callan callan yeah um and they've got an amazing bar they've got beauty treatments facial treatments they they do microneedling uh hydrofacials uh manicures pedicures places very instagrammable um, and it's just so convenient like i'm in oxford street all the time so to be able to like pop in and it's right around the corner from um mortimer house which i love going there for lunch so it's in a really good location and they have kindly um invited me down to get a kind of self-love pamper day so i've got a facial booked in i've got a manicure booked in um, they also do massages so they have a special offer at the moment where for valentine's day you can book a package and you get 
uh, you get a pedicure, a facial, massage, prosecco, and you can really like make a good day out of it. So highly recommend, you know, if you're interested, check it out. I'll leave there just like details down below and the price as well. You can also bring your bae, your loved one, um, maybe a mum or sister or boyfriend or husband, whoever you want to bring. But um, yeah, I'm going to check out the space. Um, but obviously first on the agenda is coffee. <laughs> So here is where I'm getting my pedicure and doesn't the vibe look very Moroccan? It looks so cool. Yeah, they have a really nice space down here. You feel like you're somewhere completely different, which is really nice. And then they have all their treatment rooms, which I'll be getting a facial as well. Gosh, I don't know why I look so washed out today, but um, I'm in this little cove area and i'm about to have my rose pedicure which is so lovely um so i think what i really want to do i'm just going to enjoy this moment so i'm going to do like a video montage of everything all the treatments um and if you guys do have any questions then you can let me know but i'll try and go into more detail um like later this evening when i'm home but so far i've got my coffee next to me and i'm just like i'm already feeling very zen not been awake that long so my voice is still a bit croaky but nothing that a cup of coffee can't fix and i got me and my lovely dog on there 
I say dog, he's more like a fur baby. So we're going to Penny Hill Park for a lovely romantic getaway. So I thought why not treat myself and get a little bit of pampering done along the way. So I need to pack. Um, also I need to go to my appointment. So we're actually leaving to go to Penny Hill tomorrow. But I like to pack because I like to have everything organised and all that good stuff. So... Yeah, I better get myself ready. I better drink my coffee, fix this hair, and make my way into town. Hey guys, so, so sorry, I totally forgot to vlog, but we've actually arrived at Penny Hill Park. So, yeah, we've just checked in our rooms. I'll show you guys around, but it's not really anything super special but the bathroom is pretty special because you can see that bathtub and a tv right there um i mean it is nice it's, i mean i don't even know what i'm saying i think i'm i just sound so bougie like so you stay at some amazing places and this is just as amazing it's huge this is the bedroom we've got wardrobes we have a whole living space area which is great because we're here for two nights and then come down here and this is the huge bathroom. We've got a massive shower, you can hear the echo. This bathtub is gonna be where I'm at with the TV on. And then we've got his and hers, sinks and mirrors, the whole vanity area. It's just really pretty. So um, yeah, I don't know what the plan of action is. We just really want this weekend to chill and relax. So, I mean, for me, that means hitting the spa every day, all day. Um, but we do have dinner booked and I am gonna shoot some content. This place is so, oh, it's a bit bright. But this place is so nice. Um, it would be silly for me to not make full use of the setting and everything so I mean that is a really nice background for me so yeah um I think firstly what I really want to do is um make a coffee and they've got a whole Nespresso machine here and chill out and then I'll check in with you guys in a bit um you can see actually my face is glowing from that facial I had at Callum Parlor can you just see the glow is real and this is great i actually shouldn't really be wearing makeup um but i'll probably take this off and then hit the sauna just to really help my skin breathe but so far that hydrofacial highly recommend it if you guys want that glow getting all that gunk out your skin and just boosting and injecting loads of hydration so it is a must um and i'll check in with you guys in a bit so guys, I actually had a shower, no, I had a bath. I had a really nice bath and I just redid my makeup, excuse the hair, but I'm really liking how like glowy it is. I feel like this is so much better than what I was having, like the makeup look I had early today. And I think it's because I used a different foundation. And this one, it's a CC Illuminating Foundation Cream from IT Cosmetics and I haven't used it in a while. And I've used it today and I'm in love with it. I really love how it just gives a very natural skin finish to your face. Um, I've done this, my skincare, used a lot of jelly products, really put that hydration back into my skin. And then I did my favourite lip combo, which is in the other room, of MAC Spice Lip Liner and MAC Shy Girl. And I just find that that is like my perfect nude lip i always try and find different variations of a nude lip um but i just feel like that's the one um that just best suits my skin type my and my skin tone i'm um, just putting on this fragrance it's yes i am by casherel beautiful i've even got the red one of this but this is the pink one and i'm gonna put on something to throw something on fix my hair so dinner this evening is super casual so I don't know exactly what I'm gonna wear. Tomorrow's the night where we're gonna go to Michelin style restaurant. So I wanna keep it quite nice and bougie for tomorrow. But I think today I might just do like nice top, jeans. I think that's it. I need it out for dinner. And our room is actually in the old stables of the property. 
which is so like, medieval looking. It's really special. Um, but we don't know where we're going for dinner. There's lots of nooks and crannies. I feel like I can probably give you a better look around tomorrow when it's like daylight. Yeah, I'll press the green button. You love tormenting me. I do. Look at How nice. Gosh, so just took some pictures. The breakfast selection here is amazing. Um, I couldn't actually really show you because there was just too many people, but I'll insert some pictures and little videos I took on my phone. Um, but now we're going on a little walk to walk off a big breakfast out. Just walked into a branch, not very cool. And yeah, they've this whole place they've got a walking trail which I think is really nice if you don't want to always just be in the spa or if you just want to walk around basically we love walking so that is what we are going to do and then I think we'll hit the spa after that um can't remember if I told you we took some pictures but yeah shot some content for this what I was wearing um I'm actually wearing a really lovely sage green wear set which is super comfortable usually I go for seamless but this set's really comfortable I'll show you or I'll insert pictures um, and yeah god it's really bright now can't really see me but there we go right let's explore something about said something like oh that's really good luck I like the Puritan, she goes, luck, sounds a bit like. No, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm a Puritan. You are a white adder, aren't you? I'm a black adder for sure. Gosh, guys, look at this cool entryway. This is definitely a picture scenario. I don't know why my camera's so exposed. There we go, pop that champagne. Woo! Lovely. God, I've had this for a whole year. So guys, it's been some time. I'm so sorry. I was just really enjoying the spa and making full use of it um, and just relaxing basically. Um, so you guys didn't miss much, but they had a huge array of like sauna steam rooms. It was so good. I absolutely am obsessed they had this rose steam room and I can still smell on my skin rose even though I've had a shower um, and it's quite appropriate because what I'm wearing is very like floral themed so this is what I'm wearing for this evening um, we are going for dinner um, to their Michelin style restaurant can't remember the name of it but you will see it I'll probably do like a little clip of like the menu where I have the name and we're doing a six course tasting menu. So it's literally, we go there and it all comes to us. There's no thinking, there's no going through a menu and figuring out what you wanna eat. You just sit, relax, and they take care of the rest. So this dress I've worn before, but not very often. Um, I really like it. It's just, it's very like autonomous winter-esque, but it's still very feminine and nice, so. Hey guys, so I am back home now. I've just been doing some work and I just wanted to update the vlog. Um, so basically we had the best time. Sorry, I didn't get a chance to really vlog that much. It was just, I wanted to really like enjoy the moment and be there, but I highly recommend it. It's only 45 minutes away from London and we honestly had such a lovely time. The spa was 
superb um chef's kiss to that um so the plan for the rest of the afternoon i've been working shooting as you can see from that all behind me um i've actually got a cooking class with primrose bakery and first aid beauty for the launch of their new line so what i really need to do is kind of set up for that we're going to be baking some cookies which is going to be so nice um so yeah i need to set up for that get my zoom and all that sort of stuff all ready and then start baking so yeah the light is still out which i'm very happy about um it's i think it's like four o'clock um but it means that summer is coming because the sun is still out so yeah also i've kind of filtered around with my settings and i don't know if my camera is too overexposed like i look so bright let me know in the comments down below if it's been an issue because it's definitely been an issue for me but i honestly don't feel like i've really done anything different to my camera i was fiddling around with it but i don't know like now i'm like so overexposed it's great for dark settings but i don't know anyway oh, two spots there. i feel like when you go to a sauna or like a spa or like, or like a facial your skin will always get worse before it gets better and it just like pushes is it tmi tmi talking about spots on here but yeah i just had a little mini breakout <sighs> right i better go and sit up i don't even know why i'm here chatting because i got things to do i've got some of my ingredients out here all set up so thank you to primrose bakery for that and then first day beauty just sent some of their amazing products which right now i just feel like i'm in need of really cool spatula um we've got some of their products i think this is the new one wild oat hydrating toner got some other products here and an apron oh my god that's so cool right so i just read the press release and actually this is the um, new product it's the hydrating eye cream so it has hyaluronic acid in it. So that is what we are celebrating. So that is what we're celebrating while we're doing cooking today. Um, I need to put this apron on, but I'm nowhere to put you guys. Might need to put you there. How nice is this? And red is definitely my color. <laughs> Tighten this up. Okay, that's a bit better. Feeling bad. Non, non toxic to also be non irritating. So, part of our clean story is that we make sure we aren't using ingredients like artificial fragrance, alcohol, colorants, none of that we find in our formula. Plus, we are proud to be cruelty free. People are going crazy, so very lucky today. Um, so, has everybody got in front of them their ingredients that we sent out to you? Yeah, we all good, all prepared? Brilliant, brilliant. Okay, so first thing, we are going to grab your large bowl and you are going to pop in your flour mix. So this one has your flour and your bicarbonate of soda in there. So if you rip the top of that one and toss that in the bowl. You're doing okay, brilliant. And then the next one you're going to need is your dough and sugar. This is what's going to make your cookies sweet but also really nice and crunchy. So grab your Demerara sugar and pop that in the bowl as well. Inside our bodies as well as outside today. 
sorry, real quick, I just put here on mute my phone. So I'm putting this brown sugar in the full thing. Yeah, the full thing. It's all weighed out for you. We've done all the hard work, don't worry. Now my brown sugar and now my oats. Yeah, perfect. Brilliant. The three big packets, pretty much, other than the icing sugar. Please don't put the icing sugar in. So here is the finished result. Some of these are a lot burnt than usual, but luckily I know somebody, aka my boyfriend, who loves burnt bits like that. This is the filling, which I think I put too much milk in here. And although I just put this in the freezer, so it's a bit harder. And they haven't flattened, which I'm a bit annoyed about, but this is what they look like. And I have to say, they actually taste really, really good. Considering they're quite thick. But I think what I'm gonna do is literally, that's a horrible one. This is a better one. I think what I'm gonna do is just eat them like this. Otherwise I think it's gonna be just too sweet for me. So yeah. So thank you to First Aid Beauty. I don't know why I did that. First Aid Beauty for hosting such a lovely class and Primrose Bakery. That's my boyfriend in the background watching the Winter Olympics. Um, so I actually need to do a little bit more work, but I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. I think this is a nice ending with my little cake treats. I'm gonna clear up the kitchen sit down and watch my favorite netflix series so thank you so much guys for watching and i'll see you in my next vlog <laughs>